Today, we are here to answer a question that has been around for all of time. Who makes the best chicken sandwich? Hello everybody, it is Matthew. Welcome back to a brand new video. And today, we're here with a new episode of Who Makes the Best? And on today's episode, we're gonna see who makes the best chicken sandwiches. This has been probably the most highly requested Who Makes the Best? And today, we're gonna be going to six different well-known nationwide fast food restaurants that are known for their chicken sandwiches. And we're gonna be taste testing and seeing who has the best chicken sandwich. Now it is time to see if anybody wants some free chicken sandwiches. So does anybody want free chicken? Free chicken sandwiches, anybody? Oh my gosh, what is this? Oh! Who's that, Caden? What are you guys doing? You guys want free chicken? Hey, I want free chicken sandwiches. Caden and Serenity are both here. They want free chicken sandwiches. Anybody else, free food. Free chicken sandwich. Free chicken sandwich. What hey, on earth? On you want free chicken? Yes. Hold Let's. On. Up <laughs> Let's go get some chicken. Okay, so we are here with a new episode of Who Makes the Best. On today's episode, we are doing probably the most highly requested thing: chicken sandwiches. We have six places on the list today. First off, we're gonna go over what we are judging off of. We have taste, one to 15. The chicken, one to 10. If that is too crispy, not crispy enough, whatever, that's your judging. We have the bread and toppings. That is on a one to seven basis. Some don't have toppings. Don't take off points if they don't have toppings. Just if they do, judge that. Presentation, one to three. That also includes, obviously, the sustivity of the restaurant. And then for a total of four to 35, we're gonna go over the six places. Chick-fil-A, Popeyes, KFC, McDonald's, Zaxby's, and Wendy's. Originally, I wanted to also include Raisin Cane's on this list. They probably would have won, but the closest Raisin Cane's is 45 minutes away. And I really don't feel like driving 45 minutes just to go to uh, eat a chicken sandwich and then come back. So those are the six places. A lot of good fast food places that are known for chicken sandwiches. And we're gonna be taste testing all of them to see who makes the best. Uh, this is Serenity's first episode of Who Makes the Best. We are gonna start with predictions, Benjamin. I don't know what your hair is, but we will go ahead and do your prediction first. Can't. <laughs> can't really see. Hold on. Okay, so here, there's your with. Shed the curtains. <laughs> uh, I'm going Zaxby's. You're going Zaxby's. I Why know. do you think Zaxby's over the two? Theirs are very buttermilky. So you're going Zaxby's. I am going to go with the classic Chick-fil-A, but I have a confession to make. Lots of you guys know I really only eat chicken as like my main protein. I eat some very so often, but not too much. I have actually never had Popeye's chicken sandwich, KFC's, Zaxby's, or Wendy's. That's probably the biggest shocking fact ever heard in Matthew Snooski channel history. I'm going with Chick-fil-A. I feel like those Zaxby's can definitely make a run, but I'm going to go Chick-fil-A. Okay, now you guys do your predictions, right, whoever wants right. to start. Right. Wendy's. Wendy's. I recently had Wendy's chicken sandwich, and it was amazing. It was really good. So, I'm going to go Wendy's. You're going Wendy's. Yes. Okay, Serenity, what is your predictions? I already know what she thinks. Chick-fil-A, okay. So, we have two Chick-fil-A's, uh, one, I've already forgot, you said Zaxby's, he said Wendy's. So, the first place we are going to is I have no idea where, we'll see you when we get there. A chicken sign up. Dude, are those two chi are those two chickens? <laughs> oh man, this is unreal! This is, oh, there's more chickens! There's more chickens! <laughs> okay, so we have got Popeyes. As you see here, this is gonna be my first time ever trying Popeyes. Benjamin demanded no pickles. Oh, actually it does. Okay. 
Okay, this is first time ever for me trying Popeyes. I mean, it's a bad. Very crunchy. I don't like this. It's okay, it doesn't taste bad. Yeah, I'm gonna say I'm not the biggest fan of this. Kind of dry. Yeah, the, yeah, the 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 chicken. It's very it's, it's very crispy. But it has no flavor whatsoever. Yeah, the, just the chicken itself is very dry. I will say the bun is really flavored. Try just I, the bun a little I bit. I know the bun is good. The mayonnaise are good, but the bun is good. The chicken is not. The chicken tastes like some dry shredded chicken you get at like it's a store. Not and it was cold. I don't need some chicken, so I have no idea. Chicken is crispy, it's just like the actual like chicken meat is dry, I think. It is by itself. As you bite into like the middle, it starts to taste better. Because there's more sauce, it gives it more flavor. Basically, so basically when there's less chicken, yes. it's better. Yeah, because the bun. <laughs> Yeah, the butt. I do it literally just now. I was eating just the butt. I threw the rest of the chicken in the bag. Of a chicken sandwich. It's, got, it's chicken, right? I'm gonna give it an eight. You can eat a chicken sandwich for the chicken. Popeyes was pretty solid. Um, some good and some bad. Uh, the next place we were going to is maybe Wendy's, depending on if that one right it's there is not, open. Like we could walk. Okay, yeah. There's, in the okay, yeah. Someone's in the drive-through, unless they're just talking to nobody. They uh, could be. Yeah, you can show on the camera. Like, I don't know. So, Wendy's, uh, we will be there in literally five seconds. Your mom's mom. Welcome to Wendy's. Everybody hide. We make everything fresh. Caden, so before we get started with Wendy's, where can uh, everybody watching this video go buy these amazing shirts that me and you are you wearing? You can buy these shirts and the link in the description below. Okay, so we have Wendy's chicken sandwiches. That was there is Wendy's chicken sandwiches. Doesn't look too crispy. Did you say sandwich. Sandwiches. Okay, you, you take it. a good chunk. Oh, oh, oh. What? <laughs> what just happened? I just got burnt. What that was is... that, bro? What was that? Okay. Some liquid this just. Is... I just got burned. I... What is this? The liquid. It's, it's like oil or something. Bro, from this butter. Ow! Bread. I actually like got burned. I... Popeyes at least looks like real chicken. I feel like this kind of oh. looks more processed. Yeah, I mean, look at that. Uh, what? Okay, yeah, I, I mean, I haven't tried it yet. I mean, it's good, yeah. Oh, it's hot. Chicken is definitely more flavorful. It's really juicy chicken, not dry. Yeah. That's really good. The bun is pretty good, too. Like, not as good as Popeyes, but it's good. I don't know, I think it's good. Definitely better than Popeyes because the chicken's actually flavorful, but I still feel like it's lacking something. Like I would say this is like a B plus sandwich. If that makes sense. Everything's like B plus. The bun wasn't as good. Chicken was better. I feel like it's pretty even. Popeyes for me. There's no mayonnaise on this. We asked for mayonnaise. Wow. One for presentation. One for toppings. Actually, I don't know one for toppings, but. So uh, the next place, um, let's see, everybody, everywhere else is on the east side. So I have no idea. It'll be one of the next four, obviously, will be the next place. Rat. Hey. <laughs> okay, so we have the Chick Fil A. I think the bun definitely wins for me. Oh, this is, this is so good. I'm gonna eat all this. The chicken, though, here's the thing that I think sets Chick-fil-A alone. The, the, just the chicken itself is so flavorful. Yeah. Like, this is probably the only chicken sandwich I could eat without the breading and still and really enjoy. Taste is good. Even though this doesn't have as much breading as the other places, it still, like, has that crispiness. Mm -hmm. The bun wins for me. Out of the buns. I mean, honestly, I like it thin. The chicken's the most flavorful. I guess this beats anything from today so far. Mm -hmm. I think Zaxby's still could win. One, Zaxby's has Texas toast buns. Really? Yes. I feel like Caden covered the the saying of the chicken that it has the most flavor throughout it without the breading. Yeah. Two. I like the thin. Actually, you know what? Come to think of it, you know like. How thin this 
Okay, so Chick-fil-A was good as always. The next place we are going to, I think, is going to be McDonald's. We will see you there. I've had a taste! I don't have to show! <laughs> Spicy! No, they gave, did they give us the wrong uh, ones? Did I they really? Well, you, can, you can look at it and see if it's spicy. I don't know the difference. I've never had a spicy chicken sandwich because I don't, I don't like spicy chicken because then it just overwhelms the chicken. Okay, here we go. This actually does look good though, I'm going to say. Look at this. Okay, here we go. I kind of like it. I don't think this is as good as Zaxby's or um, Chick-fil-A. But I definitely think this is better than Popeyes. And I'm gonna say it's great over here. It's fine. It's fine. It's kind of good, but I got a little plain. For the money. No, this was still like, how much was this? This one was more than Popeyes. Popeyes has okay. been the cheapest so far. Actually, no, that's a lie. Chick-fil-A was the cheapest. Well, I can't eat any more chicken. Taste-wise, I don't know. It did have really good flavoring in the breading. You could tell, like, you could see the seasoning all inside of it. Oh yeah, the breading was pretty good. It had a really good amount of crispiness to it. Uh, the McDonald's, I think it was good. It wasn't great. It wasn't the best by any means, but it was a good solid sandwich. I'm gonna give it. I'm gonna give it a nine on taste. Um, chicken. The bun wasn't very good. I didn't like the buns, but it was okay. It's fine. Chicken is crispy, and I like that. Who doesn't like crispy chicken? But other than that, nothing really surprised me. It's average. It's okay. Cause he brings chicken. So we've made it to Zaxby's. What does this say? Did that say subscribe? It's subscribe, guys. It's awesome. Is it really? What on earth is this? Okay, so time to eat some Zaxby's. Okay, you open the. Oh. Wait. God. Look how crispy that it's was. It's giant. This is amazing. What are you talking about? Look at the meat. Oh no, wait, camera can't do it. It's literally like glistening. Yeah, that white. looks like some chicken right there. That is so good. It's probably about equal or yeah. a little bit less than chicken. Yes, yeah, she doesn't me. agree with me. Um, she doesn't like it either. I'm 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 rating this above Chick Fil A. This is like, this is like, maybe the best thing I've ever tasted on this series. I think it's because I like this sauce. The bun doesn't have any flavor. I will say that. I think just chicken for chicken though. I like this as much as Chick Fil A. Oh yeah, the chicken. I love the sauce. Well, that means you're low on toppings then, Kaden. I, I think that's the only thing that's different in between me and you is I love the sauce and you don't, and that's what's. Making me Imagine really if like you got it. this with no sauce, which you could this do. Would probably be a but because the sauce is better. I love this sauce. What about the chicken? The chicken I could drink this sauce. That being said, the chicken is very good. I tasted it without the sauce. I, I got a few bites without the sauce. Chicken. I'm gonna say right now, chicken was better than the chicken. Like, I'll be able to get the chicken in here. The taste. If I'm going by the taste of the chicken itself the chicken it's getting really high I really think that chicken was better than Chick-fil-A and that has never came out of I've never said it in my life what that someone else's chicken is better than Chick-fil-A's okay so right now we are about to head to KFC our final place and we will Wait, see you there Okay, so we have KFC, the it's, final. I've never had, I've never ate at KFC. That's not even a joke. Oh my god. That's actually really good. The crunch. That's actually pretty good. I don't know if it'll be Chick fil A or Zaxby's, but. Not, I don't know. I feel the same way about this as I do about, uh, what you call it. Never heard of that restaurant. I don't think we went there. McDonald's. This is like a little bit... for me. 
this is a little bit better version of McDonald's is what I would say. I like the breading. It's very crispy. The chicken is a little bit dried out, but got some flavor. I think a little bit more flavor than McDonald's had. The bun, I actually like the bun. Do you agree? I do like the bun. Yeah, yeah that's why I said it first. You think Jack Harlow would approve? I don't know. I guess we should listen to some Jack Harlow. Oh, she's giving a perfect score. What? Whoa, what? Chicken. Do you like it that Out much? Out of 10. Yeah, that is I think it's going to get rough. I think that's going to be a third place. I think that's a third place. I think this is so far... Well, I don't know, because actually you guys rated Wendy's really high. So Wendy's actually made... I don't know. Based off of Serena's decision, this could tell the KFC in the city. Why? Did she have the KFC? Okay. So, that is KFC. We have tried all six chicken sandwiches. It is now time to tally up the scores to see who makes the best. Okay, so everybody, we have added up all the scores to all six places, and we have the winner of who makes the best chicken sandwiches. The most highly requested one has an official winner. So we're gonna start at the bottom. Coming in last place, there's probably gonna be some people upset about this oh, and God. shocked at a score, average score of 18 in last place. Popeyes! That's Popeyes, not fit, well not surprising for us, but probably for the viewers. Popeyes finishes in last place with an 18. I guess Popeyes had an off day compared to what people are used I'm to. I'm still eating this. Coming in at fifth place, their crispy chicken sandwich. McDonald's! McDonald's comes in fifth place with an average score of 21.75. And yet it wasn't even there. Now on to fourth place. They barely finished above McDonald's with an average score of 22. Wendy's. Wendy's finishes in fourth place. And now we have a giant jump. The next highest score is at a 26.5. Coming in third place. KFC. KFC comes in third place. And that takes us to the final two. These two were within one point of each other average score wise oh, no. with a 28.5 above the second place 27.5 the winner of who makes the best chick-fil-a chick-fil-a wins the who makes the best zaxby's comes in second at a 27.5 i had zaxby's winning um Shame. on mine um but well zaxby's, mine were tied on the paper I guess. zaxby's loses by one point average wise Chick-fil-A wins the Who Makes the Best Sandwich. I feel like that was sandwich. a pretty, was a pretty good succession affair yeah. for rating there. Yeah. Were bad. yeah, they were all pretty good. Yeah, they were all pretty bad. So everyone, right now, go comment in uh, the comments what item you would like to see next for Who Makes the Best, uh, fast food, whatever. We were thinking maybe chicken nuggets, mac and cheese. Don't comment hamburgers. I don't eat hamburgers. hamburgers. It's never happening. Hamburgers. It's never happening, hamburgers. guys. So comment what food item you want to see next. Also, make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe. Thank you all for watching. Have a great day, and I will see you in the next video.